I'm Stephanie. I'm Teresa. And today we're going to be making a cupcake liner wreath DIY style. Ain't she cute? Beautiful. Let's get to it. Okay, first things first. What I tried to do, I tried to get everything from um, Dollar Tree, uh -huh. but our Dollar Tree sucks. So if some of it's it really from Dollar Tree, yeah. like this foam ring that I got, that's mostly circular. Mostly circular. <laughs> Yeah. And I got some paint from the Dollar Tree, and I just painted this foam board. Go ahead and do it this ahead of time. You want to do that first? Yeah. Because this is three coats, and you can still see the green. I have an idea. Uh-huh. Pool noodle. They sell white pool, pool noodles. Pool noodle. Pool noodle. <laughs> and then you can cut the pool noodle in half and have two of those, or you can take yeah. the whole pool noodle and have a real big one. You just really went into it. <laughs> I love your words. I yes. Love them. I love the Stephanieisms. I love them so much. But yeah, a pool noodle would work very well. They're, they're going to start coming up here soon, so. Yeah. yeah. You can do that. But I just grabbed one that was already ready. Good to go. Small. And then you, I also had to get cupcake liners. Yeah. That's our theme. And Dollar Tree, again, did not have it because the lady, I'm going to put her in the description. I thought she you said, had a beef with somebody at Dollar Tree. I was like, <laughs> No, no, no. The story. I'm surprised. There usually is some kind of beef at Dollar Tree. That's hilarious. <laughs> but mm -hmm. our Dollar Tree didn't have any, so I had to go to Walmart and get these. You get three seventy-five count of whatever color you want. So we're going for spring. So, so how much were those? We can go over the cost. These were, I don't remember. I didn't pay with my card, so mm -hmm. I have to go online and look. But I'll put it all That's in the my, description. It was probably about, I want to say it was probably, I think it was one nineteen for the 75 count. Whereas Dollar Tree, it would be a dollar twenty-five, and you probably don't get seventy-five even. No, I don't think so. They don't. They give you so. smaller quantities. I don't know. Maybe our Dollar Tree doesn't have it. Then I got this from the Dollar Tree. It's a rope to hang the wreath, and that was a dollar twenty-five. Let me put it down. You can make seventy-five wreaths out of that. You really could. Mm -hmm. So that's good. Yeah. So what you need is scissors, stapler, and cupcakes, and a glue gun. Yeah. Okay. You're going to count what I did. You're going to count seven lines, liners, cupcake liners. So two, three, four, five. I don't love that six, sound. Huh? Seven. Okay. There's seven. And then I'm going to do five also to okay. make to make little spots that you don't need a big flower. So it, like you get a smaller flower. My words For again. It's I a like filler. That. So I'm going to count five now. One, two, three, Suspense. four, five. And you just keep on doing that. You want to go seven, five, seven, five, seven, five. Okay. So let's do that. Okay. One, two. That's extras because there's only two left. You could mix up colors or do you not want to? Is that, is that wild you could. You could do anything. You could mix up colors. You could do one set of color, whatever you want to do. So. Okay, so I already got these separated out. So what I'm going to do is we're going to do different designs with the different colors. Okay. But first, we need to staple them. So you got your seven count and your five count. Okay. And you're just going to staple the bottom of it. Watch there be no staples in here. Let there be staples. Good So job. it just keeps it together. Now, fast forward to us already counting these out and we got them all stapled. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to make the flowers. What you want to do is you want to flip them inside out because okay. you want the white part on the bottom when you make the flowers. Gotcha. Okay. Because you want the colors to come out. And then you're going to fold it in half. Okay. Make it even. It has to be even. I'm joking. It doesn't have to be perfectly even. I was like, <laughs> you're like, I can't so do this. angry about it. Okay. So half. It looks good. Can you see? I don't know. Well, okay. Oh, it looks like a tiny little, little fan. Little Japanese fan. Yeah. Well, on those lines much. that are folded, you're going to cut. And what I did, there's another line in here for where where the ridges start. You're going to cut to that line. Cut to the ridges. Uh-huh. Okay. Where the ridges start. Okay. Yes. Thank you for teaching me this craft today, Stephanie. Oh, you're welcome. So fun. You are good at craft, no matter what you I say. am good at craft. <laughs> I am not good at explaining it. <laughs> it's okay. Like a poo noodle. Poo noodle. Poo noodle. <laughs> <laughs> You're a better student. I really am. 
<laughs> and then you're gonna fold it again. Okay. Let me see. Fold it again. Get them straight. And it's okay if you kind of wrinkle it up. You're gonna. It's gonna. Things are gonna happen anyway. Mm -hmm. And where that fold is from that fold, you're gonna cut it again to that line. Are you having fun yet? I am very. <laughs> You're having, like, I don't know. Very what I'm doing. fun. I, I am fun. <laughs> you fun. don't know what I was going with it. <laughs> and then what I do, you can either put two cut lines right here. Or what I do if I have strong scissors, I'm just gonna fold keep it folded over. And I'm gonna measure with my eyeballs. Mm -hmm. I love when you eyeball measure. Because you need five total cuts. So like here. Yeah, so you're going to do two. <laughs> this is confusing to explain. So you already have one in this fold. Then you're going to put one right here. Okay. And then you're going to put another one right here. And if you open it up, two, it's going to be five. One, two, three, four, five, six. No. One, two, three, four, five. You have six. The cuts. Oh, cuts. I thought you meant petals. Not the actual petals. Yeah, the cuts. Like, you also I was like, one, <laughs> two. <laughs> but yeah, you can open it up and you can cut it from here. You don't, if your scissors aren't that great. It, it, whatever. What, however it no, feels. No, I think that, I think that was good. That was good. So you're going to open it up. My scissors are crap and they did it. Get these bitches out of here. I like the noise. It was a fun one. Okay, and then you're going to start separating them. So hold it. Oh, this reminds me of a project that is in Spanish. Mm -hmm. You're not gonna fold the the tops that we cut, but you're gonna squish together the bottom. Like that. Oh, all the way to the staple? Yeah, but just don't rip it. Be careful with okay. it. I haven't ripped I didn't rip one. So <gasps> but this one on the right? I've only done one. Not like 30. <laughs> She didn't do any prep. And then you're just going to do the same thing to each layer until you get to the last one. My, I, mine don't look as good. What am I doing but It takes some tries. I don't you have just got to squish it. You got to squish. Squish even more? Like, squish. Like hard? Squish it Not and squish it good? Thing. Squish it real good. If you want to watch me, I'll show you. I yeah. I literally... And then I just start folding and squish together. Or some of them I don't even fold. I just squish. That's a good old Fulton squish right there. That's a good yeah. technique. Because right. it can be squished together because guess what? It, what's going to happen at the end? We're going to squish it. We're going to fluff it up. Oh. <laughs> Opposite of squish. And you can squish it together like this, but it'll be fine. We're going to squish, squish. But the bottom one, you're basically doing the same thing. You're squishing. Squish it together. It looks like a carnation. Isn't that cute? This one looks like a St. Patrick's Day carnation. <laughs> All of it. <laughs> it really does. Or it on your lapel. Okay. And then, or behind your ear. You can leave it like that. And a hat. As a hat. In your bra. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Mm -hmm. just that <laughs> Continue. <laughs> and then you're just going to fluff it out. I fluff it out. Just mm -hmm. kind of pull on it. Mm -hmm. I did it. I'm trying to show it to the camera. Ta da! What do you think? That. Good. You okay. Did, you did so There's good. There's one. Okay. So the pink one, it's going to look like this. Okay. All right. Oh, I only had one. I'm sorry. A blue one. Do you want a blue one? Do a blue one? The blue, blue, blue. And the same? Or a yellow one. It don't matter. I want the blue. Let's do blue. Okay. So we're going to fold. Way. Oh, wait. Inside out. Same thing. Just a different design. Are we doing the same cuts? Um, same cuts, but the top, the design will be different. Okay. Well, we didn't cut it, so we're doing just, we're doing an extra my step. staples way in my way. I know it, it but it's okay. We'll get okay. over it. <laughs> okay, now mm. to do the star, not the star, the triangle tips. One point of a star. <laughs> you, you got it. triangle tip. <laughs> <laughs> there you so go. you're basically going to make the top of a triangle. You're going to cut the edge. And then you're going to do the same thing. You're going to go to the point of it. There you go. And it doesn't have to be perfect. I like it. So whatever you want to do. Yeah, nature is not perfect. Tones. Yes. Okay. And then you just do it for each one. It made a sun. Oh, I made mine way pointier than you. Yeah, you did. <laughs> I haven't made one like that. I thought you went all the way down to, okay. It's going to look different. It'll be a chrysanthemum. 
So this is Everywhere. what mine looks like, and this is what Teresa looks like. I, I took my point all the way down to the circle. Oh. <laughs> so pretty. Oh, wow, you really did. Yep. <laughs> you don't have to do all that, but if you want to, you can. Well, I'm done. See what's going on. All right, now. we're going to do the same thing. Just pull and pinch. The old pull and pinch. All right, so mine Teresa. was, mine is, uh, there we go. Oh, wait, I didn't fluff it. Ah. It's pretty much there. So, so this is what you get when you don't do skinny triangles yeah. right here. And this is what you get when you do the skinny ones. And it looks like a... A thistle. That's kinda, pretty cool. Chrysanthemum. That's a different design that you can do. Love it. All right. Now we're going to do the round tips. You got one more cut. Yeah. That's do, it. Let's do it too. Or, okay. And then how do you do the round? Just you just do a round. Mm -hmm. Almost like a triangle, but you don't make a pointy so tip. Don't maybe. go all the way down to the bottom of the circle. Nope. You don't, I mean, you can, but then you just go make it around. So just bring it around town. It's difficult. My hands don't go that way. We'll call that round. Mm -hmm. Bring it <laughs> that was more straight. Town. <laughs> there goes my tongue. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is the round one. It doesn't have to be perfect, like I said. Isn't it pretty? Like you. Are much better at on details. There we go. We finish at the same time. So we have our triangle, our straight, pointy, and round. Round. All right. And then we just need about 30 more. Yeah. Let's get them. Okay. Okay. All right. So we have all the ones that we've done. And now we're going to take our wreath so pretty. and, get and we're going to glue them. So we're kind of how do we want to do this? You want to figure out how you want to put them on there, you know, place them okay. beforehand. So this is a smaller reef, so we probably won't need all of them, but take a burp break. Oh, I love these blue and pink ones. They're so pretty. I do too. So we just start gluing. Glue the inside circle first, maybe? Yeah. Let's start. Okay. Are we glue in this direction or are we gluing? Yeah. You just glue whatever you feel comfortable. Like you just imagine it being there. Okay. So we're maybe glue it on the side. So I'm thinking it's on the going side straight. Well. Okay. The side of it. I'm going to go ahead and glue some other parts so it stays together. That's really smart. 10 points if you don't burn yourself. Beautiful. Nice and springy. That is very springy. All right, guys. The flowers are on. Yes. Mm. And for the length for the rope. Yes, I bought a rope for this. Now, oh it depends gosh. on what you have um, on the door. Yeah, it depends on what kind of length. I want a short one because at my, ho at my house, I have the little yeah, fence on the wall. So you would just do like this where it hides? Yeah, where it would hide. Yeah. Or you can put it up to where you show it. It, dep it just depends. So, so we're doing a hidey hole. We're doing we're doing a hidey hole. We're doing a hidey hole. Hidey right. hole. Flipper down. Don't burn yourself, Stephanie. I will. Okay. So do. It's too long to. I cut it. I cut it real bad. So now we if we glue this. Mm -hmm. See what I'm saying? It's so more. Do you a beady poo? Oh, it's the end. And now we're of the row. Just give it a little extra strength. I did my job. <laughs> you did. I, that extra little pep, pep, it really, you skipped it, pepped it right into place. That's why you always need a helper. Okay. We're done. What do you think? Did, make sure we don't need to flip it again. A little wonky. Oh, yeah, that looks good. <laughs> so you can also I do always it. always act like I'm surprised every time. What? This I is, know. This is DIY. <laughs> we try things to see if they work. Well, we're kind of flippity jibs. Isn't it pretty? You could do this in the brown ones, too, or just white. Just to show you edges. what you did on the back with yeah. the rope. And if you want to even fuller, you can even do a whole nother rope. Like this. Yeah, you can. It's so versatile. I know. Isn't that pretty? It's fully customizable. We're going to do a Halloween one too. Oh my gosh, yes. Mm -hmm. We hope you enjoyed this. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Share. Remember? And oh subscribe yeah, us. we did that in the beginning. Share. share. And subscribe because 
YouTube doesn't suggest us if you don't. So that's true. And it's free. You'd be helping us it's out. It's free. Until next time, y'all. Bye. Bye.